welcome to English with Leanne. As you can see, I am still in Joshua Tree, and right here, there is a Joshua Tree. In fact, I am surrounded by lots of Joshua Trees. Still very windy. And I'm going to give you another idiom. As a reminder, down below this video in the description, I will link other videos that have idioms that I did in national parks. Um, so far, I've done Joshua Tree and the Grand Canyon, but I might add some other links in the future. So, today's idiom, without much further ado, is to be on tenterhooks. And I'm doing this idiom because I used it just this week. And you're going to hear it and you're going to think it's a lot like to be on edge or to be on the edge of your seat. Also, if you missed those videos, go back and watch my last two, but you'll get to learn about those ones. So to be on tender hooks is to be waiting, nervous, anxious, and unsure about what is going to happen. So tender hooks. That is a weird word, tenterhooks. And this is a very old word. This idiom might be a little more British, but we definitely use it in America because I used it and I'm American. But in the old days when we made fabric from wool and we made it into cloth so that we could make clothes from it, make something from it, we had to wash it and then for it to dry, we would hang it on something called tenter hooks. It's not a word we use other than in this idiom today that I know of, but to be on tenter hooks is to be, instead of sitting on the edge of the seat or just on edge, it's almost like you're hanging there waiting to see what happens. So say you sent a letter to someone and you're waiting to hear their response and you're nervous about what they're going to say. You might be like, oh gosh, I'm just on tenter hooks. I don't like waiting. And that's you sharing that you're feeling uneasy, that you're unsure. Another example would be that you just feel like something is about to happen, but you don't know what. And you're like, oh, I'm on tenter hooks. I really think something's going to happen. This is another idiom that you could use as to be on tenter hooks or to keep someone on tenter hooks. And if someone's telling you a story and you're just really anxious and you're hanging on their every word and you just want to know what's going to happen, you might be like, oh, tell me what's going to happen. Don't keep me on tenter hooks. And so to keep someone on tenter hooks is, like I said, very similar to keep someone at the edge of their seat and to be on edge. But again, it is more of the anxious, like to be on edge, but very much um, kind of almost like you're going to lean forward. You're on tenter hooks. You don't know if you're going to fall. You don't know if you're going to stay standing. You're just waiting. So good luck with this idiom.